Des Moines International Airport IATA, DSM, ICAO, KDSM, FAA LID, DSM is a civil military public airport three miles southwest of Des Moines, in Polk County, Iowa, United States. It has 21 connections to major airline hubs. This airport is in the National Plan of Integrated Airport Systems for 2017-2021, which called it a primary commercial service airport. In 2016, a record 2.48 million passengers used the airport, up 5% from 2015. The airport hosts the 132nd Wing WG of the Iowa Air National Guard. History During the 1920s the Des Moines area had several small private airports for general aviation and airmail. In 1929, the Iowa General Assembly passed a law allowing cities to sell bonds and levy assessments in order to build municipal airports. Over 80 sites were considered for the Des Moines Airport until a decision was made to build on 160 acres .65 square kilometers of farmland south of the city. Construction of the airport began in 1932 and was completed in 1933. The airport's first passenger terminal was built shortly after the airport was completed. It was replaced by a new terminal in 1950 that has been expanded and renovated several times since then. The present concourses were built in 1970, along with the remodeling of the terminal. The airport itself has expanded several times from its original 160-acre square kilometers site and now covers 2625 acres (10.6 square kilometers) of land. The airport was originally governed by the City of Des Moines Parks Department. A separate aviation department was established by the city during the 1960s, and in 1982, a separate aviation policy advisory board was established. The airport was renamed the Des Moines International Airport in 1986 to acknowledge the presence of a United States Customs Service office at the airport. In 2011, the city of Des Moines transferred control from the city to the Des Moines Airport Authority. The city retains ownership of the land but transfers title to all property and equipment to the public authority. In turn, the authority agreed to a 99 year lease on the land. In 2016, a record 2.48 million passengers used the airport, up 5% from 2015. Federal Aviation Administration records say the airport had 919,990 passenger boardings in calendar year 2008, 853,596 in 2009, and 932,828 in 2011. Expansion Interior renovation work began in 2009 on the airport and concluded in 2010. The project, designed by Brooks Borg Skiles ALLP, includes new carpets, paint, gate counters, seating, a new ceiling, signage, and a fire sprinkler system. Also included in the upgrade is a common use project allowing any airline to use any gate at the airport. A new restroom is also being added to the C concourse to allow for future concourse expansion. The airport is modernizing baggage handling capabilities with expanded processing facilities as well. In addition to work inside the passenger terminal, the airport is building a rental car facility and new parking facilities. It is also planning a new 5,000-foot runway to be extended to 9,000 feet 2,700 meters in a later phase, and a new general aviation GA apron. The new GA apron is partially in response to the failure of a reliever proposal in Audel, Iowa and restricted space in the current GA area. <laughs> <laughs> Facilities and aircraft Des Moines International Airport covers 2,625 acres 1,062 hectares at an elevation of 958 feet 292 meters above mean sea level. It has two runways, 
5 23 is 9,003 by 150 feet 2,744 by 46 meters asphalt, concrete surface, 13 31 is 9,002 by 150 feet 2,744 by 46 meters asphalt. For the 12 month period ending December 31, 2017, the airport had 70,118 aircraft operations, an average of 192 per day, 44% scheduled commercial, 13 percent air taxi, 40% general aviation and 3% military. At the time, there were 111 aircraft based at this airport, 69 single-engine, 12 multi-engine, 27 jet, 2 helicopter and 1 military. The Des Moines terminal has two concourses, Concourse A with gates A1-A5 used by Allegiant Air, Southwest Airlines, United Airlines, and United Express and Concourse C, with gates C1-C7 used by American Airlines, American Eagle, Delta Air Lines, Delta Connection, and Frontier Airlines. The airport is home to a maintenance base for Endeavour Air. Topic: Airlines and destinations. Topic: Passenger. As of January 2018, American Airlines handled 30% of DSM passengers, followed by Delta Air Lines 23%, United Airlines 21%, Allegiant Air 10%, Southwest Airlines 10%, and Frontier Airlines 5%. <laughs> Topic: Cargo Topic: Air National Guard. The Air National Guard has used the airport for decades. With the 2013 departure of the Eang's 132 D fighter wings F-16s, the unit that had flown manned aircraft for more than 70 years diversified its missions, expanding to include RPA, ISR, and cyber warfare units. These mission changes created some debate over the base's status as an aeronautical base, as the Des Moines Airport attempted to void the base's lease and charge fair market value. This was addressed in the short term by the reassignment of Black Hawk helicopters from Company C, 2nd Battalion, 147th Aviation Regiment, Iowa Army National Guard, from Boone, IA to the base, occupying the hangars that formerly held F-16s. This issue was permanently resolved by President Obama's signature on H.R. 5944, which allowed airports continued access to FAA grant funding by classifying RPA operations as aeronautical. With the addition of the Army National Guard unit to the base, a transition to a joint base status has begun. Eventually, Air Force operations will occupy the area to the west of the main gate, while Army operations will occupy the east. Statistics Annual traffic Top destinations Accidents and incidents On December 2, 1978, Douglas C-47 AN-41447 of SMB Stage Line crashed short of the runway while on a cargo flight from Chicago, Illinois. Airframe icing was a factor in the accident. On December 1, 2007, a United Express plane carrying 44 passengers slid off a taxiway while taxiing to the runway for takeoff. No one was injured, but the airport was closed for seven hours after the incident because of the winter storm moving through the area. On March 13, 2008, an Atlanta-bound ASA Delta 4704 flight was delayed more than five hours when a mouse was discovered shortly before takeoff from DSM. Officials delayed the flight to inspect the plane for any damage that the mouse may have caused. Maintenance crews checked wiring and components on the aircraft. The flight took off at 11.39 a.m. On December 18, 2010, a small Red Beechcraft Bonanza crashed while performing an emergency landing at DSM. The airport director stated that the small craft had engine problems and turned around for the airport. 
The aircraft eventually lost the engine and pilot was able to glide to the end of the runway. The aircraft clipped the end of the runway fence with its landing gear, making the nose of the craft dip into the snow. Police and emergency reported only minor injuries. On March 18, 2016, an American Airlines plane made an emergency landing at the airport after reporting smoke in the cockpit. The plane carried almost 200 passengers. It was traveling from Chicago to Phoenix when it made the landing. <laughs> 